Welcome to No Picks Given. That is, No Pick Six is Given. We're your hosts, Satan. I'm Chris. And so we're trying to do something a little different because football is probably one of the most popular sports in North America. I I completely agree with you. It, it totally so we're trying is. something different. We're both fans. Granted, Chris, you've been long, a longer fan of football than I have. I've only recently gotten to it within the last year or so. Where I've been following... So my teams, I'm going to catch so much flack for this. As you can see, it Seahawks do too. Well, we Seattle is, what, a two-hour drive? I mean, you, you've been down there. I haven't. It's about a two-hour yeah, drive. Yeah, Seattle, right? the Seattle Seahawks are probably the most popular football team in, in Canada. Because, again, we don't BC. have. I would say BC. BC, yes. I, uh, sorry, I have to agree. Yes, BC. And... Another one of my teams, here's where I catch flack. The New England Patriots. I've been a Pats fan since 2002. Um, the reason why is because it was the exact same color scheme as the Vancouver Canucks jerseys back then. That's why. And then they happen for to win me, a bunch of Super though. Bowls. So I am a fan of a winner. <laughs> Former winner. Then why are you a Canucks fan? That's hockey. I'm talking football. I know, damn but you just said you're a fan of a <laughs> you said you're a fan of a, a winner. <laughs> yeah. The fucking Pats. <laughs> and Seattle when they won their freaking Super Bowl in oh god, what was it twenty sixteen? I don't fucking know, dude. All but, I know is it was against Denver. <laughs> oh, the Broncos. Yeah, oh, that's it was against the Broncos. Mm, that was, this was a very fun year to watch <laughs> for them. <laughs> but <laughs> regardless, regardless, um, if you're wondering why, because this is only going to be on YouTube, this will not be on Spotify, like, no puck skipping. And if you're wondering why I'm wearing an NHL Arizona Coyotes jersey, it's because it's the closest thing I got, and the Super Bowl is going to be in Glendale, Arizona this year. I thought so, it was because you like, hate it, yourself. And also, I'm a Coyotes fan, so of course I hate it. What the fuck? Sounds like a you problem. What's that? Fuck if I know, dude. Well, you ordered it. Look at it. Shit. Yeah, I don't fucking remember. Really, you ordered anything. it. Oh, yeah. Cool. Well, look at that. It's my team. Ew. Your team. I don't even know what your team is. But ew, your team. I'm kidding. I actually know what your team is. You know what? Yeah. I'll give you this pass. Yep. God, that's actually kind. That's really clean, actually. Is that their away? This is uh, their alternate. Okay. All right, well, I guess I don't have to wear this anymore. No, you don't. There we go. Yes, I'm a Bills fan. You like Buffalo. You like Buffalo. <laughs> I do. They're a fun team to watch. They're a really fun team to watch. And besides, it's better than watching Steelers. <laughs> You're not wrong. I mean, but... Days of our or Steelers. or worse, it's better than, it, to be fair. Watching the Steelers is better than watching the car crash that is Arizona and Denver. I have a question: How the fuck did the Buccaneers make the playoffs when their record was like six and whatever their losses were? I think it was like six and eight. No, no, they were eight and nine. Oh, okay. Eight and nine. Still a losing record. Still a losing record. One but game it, under it 500. Helped. It all it just helps that the rest of their division was dog shit. True. I'll give you that. Um, I'll give you that. It was pretty dog shit from 
what I noticed in the standings. Um, so I actually, the only time I'll actually watch football is playoffs. I don't actually watch it. I don't watch the regular season. I follow the stats, but I don't watch the regular, yeah, same. regular season. Uh, the, when I watched my Bills play against Miami, and because they're on the Eastern Conference, they start at 10 in the morning for me. Us. Yes. Same for us. Yeah, but yeah, but you didn't have to worry about your Seahawks having to start at ten in the morning. Mm, if they're on the if they're on the road, yeah. Uh, yeah, it I it does not say when they started. Regardless, all right. But let's have a little fun here. The wild card just happened. Yep. You know a little bit of what happened throughout the wild card. I I know I know but, two scores. That's it. Fair enough. So we'll start off with Dallas uh, Cowboys versus Tampa Bay Buccaneers. I think you know who won. <sighs> yeah, the Dallas Cowgirls. And yet they beat a Tom Brady. Scriptwriters kind of forgot to write his script. <laughs> I'm a huge Brady fan. I can tell. And what's funny, what's great, so uh, at work, we have this guy, also named Chris, surprisingly. I've heard stories. <laughs> uh, is not the one I work with. He's a customer that comes in every now and then. Oh, okay, okay. <clears throat> he is a Tampa Bay Bucks fan. Okay. And... And uh, we are t- we would have good we would actually have good talks about football. And obviously, I don't know a whole lot about it. He lo- knows a lot more. He's been a fan. Well, he followed pretty much followed Brady from from um, New England. Yeah. And and but so he obviously knows a lot more about football than I do. But I still know enough that I can have conversations with him about it. Yeah. He was he he was kind of giving me flack of like yeah well, well see you in the Super Bowl and I'm like. Tom Brady's not making it to the Super Bowl. I don't know what you're on about. He's like, we'll see. I'm like, yes, we will. Lo and behold, Dallas Cowboys, 31 to 14. <laughs> I can't wait to see him next. Be wearing this. Good. But I mean, to be fair, because I'm fully expecting after the Bills versus Miami game, he's going to give me flack. So at least I, all I can say is we made it. <laughs> At least to the next round. Yeah, but you made it by the And didn't get blown out. Teeth. That? Okay. So, yeah, that leads us into Miami at Buffalo. Everybody I, had them I, as just going to get blown out. I I was certain Miami was going to get bl- lit the fuck up. And they did in the first quarter. In the first quarter. And then they had their game coming back. I mean, I, I didn't. Again, I didn't watch the game. I didn't. It was on Sunday. Sunday. Yep. So yeah, I didn't. In the first quarter, or uh, yeah, it was it was all Buffalo, and then they tied it, and Buffalo still almost lost. They are a touchdown and a field goal away from losing. And then Miami rallied late, got a touchdown. All they needed was a was a two point conversion to tie. No, not even a two point conversion. They just need they just needed a field goal to win. They needed a field goal. Yeah. Regardless, Buffalo won thirty four to thirty one, and holy shit, that fucking scared me because we had that much issue against Miami's third string quarterback. I don't know why I'm like doing this. You, it should be you doing this, not me, because it's not my turn. I was doing I was You're I was doing, doing that uh I was doing it live. Yeah. Yeah. I wanna I wanna know what YouTube has to say about it. I don't know. Um Cause even he he was fully convinced that Miami is gonna get blown the fuck out. You know, I actually didn't even watch I haven't seen his um Super Bowl picks yet. 
which is odd because I'm usually over that. Yeah, I literally, I I watched it, watching his congratulations for a few of them were fucking congratulations. Funny. Indeed. Yes. Anyway, next up, the New York Giants versus the Minnesota Vikings. Uh, please tell me that the Vikings won. Cause I hate New. I hate. Wait, Giants or Jets? Giants. Giants. I hope the Vikings won. They didn't. Do you prefer the Jets or the or the Giants? I hate both teams. I hate Jets Fair. and Giants. Fair, but uh, unfortunately, Kirk Cousins did not make it. Well, Minnesota is used to disappointment with both their hockey team and their football team. <laughs> True. <laughs> Uh, New York Giants won thirty-one to twenty-four. Okay, it was close. Yeah, fi- it was, fi- it was a game. Fi- final score was close. I'm not, I don't know how the actual game itself played out, but uh, I can actually look that up right now. Uh, it was mostly, obviously, New York. Uh, Kirk Cousins one-yard run. Uh. Nine yard pass. So they got w- one, two, three. We got three touchdowns and a, and a field goal. Where, but I mean, it was still close for most of the game. But New York pretty much never lost a lead. The only lead um, the Vikings had was the first after the first drive. It was the first drive. Yeah. Pretty much. So they are basically chasing the, the entire game for the remainder of the game. I'm not surprised. Yes. I mean, seeing as they all they've been doing that literally all season. That horseshoe up their ass finally wore off. It fell out. It fell out. <laughs> Alrighty, you can next make a up. Joke, but I'm not going to. <laughs> not yet. Uh, Baltimore Ravens versus Cincinnati Bengals. The Bengals won. Mm-hmm. That's my other team, by the way. The Bengals. Bengals. You, you like the Bengals? Yep. The Cincinnati Bengals. Joe Burrow is fucking fantastic. I will not hear otherwise. Them going to the Super Bowl last year was a fluke. Seeing as they oh. still... Seeing it... who, who, who are they playing next week? They're playing you yeah, next Bills. week. Yeah. Yeah. So, I, obviously, I want the Bills to win, but I will not be upset if the Bengals win. Okay, fair enough. I mean, I've been there. I've been there before with uh, the 49ers and the Seahawks. Oh, speaking of, oh, here we go. When did them last? Yeah, because you... <laughs> well, gonna be like, I will <laughs> for the remainder. Like I will give sad. the Seahawks credits. I'll give them credit. They still scored more than Baltimore did. It was what forty. Bengals won twenty four to seventeen. Seattle Seahawks scored twenty three. Unfortunately, though, the Forty Nine ers scored forty one. I know. Big cock Brock. Yeah, do they still have, do they still have Jimmy Gar- Garoppolo? He's injured for the rest of the season. He's not coming back. Oh, Jimmy. Yeah. And finally, (laughs) the biggest fucking bullshit blow up that I've ever seen. I'm happy I watched this game. The Los Angeles Chargers versus the Jacksonville Jaguars. Ironically, the Jags are where Nathan Rourke, our 
BC's own uh, lovely boy quarterback signed with the NFL. Good for him. He had a really good. Anyway. He had a really good season uh, with the with the Lions. Um, no, not the not not the Detroit Lions, the BC Lions, uh, CFL. Um, yeah, the for the football league that everyone makes fun of because it's shit. It, it, it is shit. This is the only football hat I own. So, but regardless, uh, Rourke, oh. even though even though Rourke is pl- was playing in the beat uh, the CFL, not the NFL, he's the real deal. He's exciting to watch. He is fine, he and is. honestly, I'm next year. Get... I'm probably gonna be be pay attention to the Jacksonville Jaguars just so I can watch Rourke. Didn't you go uh, see Rourke play at BC Place? He that this, was when he was injured. Season. And oh, because I remember, I remember you sent me. Uh, so he was sending me snaps. I was out, actually out at the bar watching the game, and I'm just like, "You're at the fucking game." Yeah, we proceeded to get our asses handed to us. Wasn't it Calgary? Cal- thanks, Calgary. Yeah, I went with my buddy who's a uh, Calgary fan, so I'm not going to any any games with him anymore. I probably would break your friend when it comes to like. I don't think. I mean, he wasn't. He wasn't being like obnoxious or anything like that. So he, he was would. actually he's he was really cool. Where I would. Yeah. Be. Yeah, but like, I'm a little pissed because the Lions did what the Canucks do. Play Suck. well during garbage time. Suck in general? No, play well during garbage time when it doesn't matter anymore. Uh, I mean, the Lions made it to they... the playoffs. True, but that, I'm talking about they, that they, game. They... Yeah. Because really like, when we left, it was like 31 to like 4. Or, or 3, sorry. No, because yeah, they got a field yeah, goal. Yeah, it was a field goal. It, yeah, thirty. Uh, it was yeah, it was like thirty-one to like three. We left. It was ended up being thirty-one to twenty. Uh, within the last five minutes. So it was your fault. I think I. I guess. I think I even said that to you. Mind you, I was pretty Probably. drunk when I said that to you. Yeah, you're a fucking hammer, dude. Regardless. Mm. L.A. Chargers versus Jacksonville Jaguars. Who do you have? Jags. Um, Correct. My uncle is actually a Chargers fan, and actually my old manager is a Jacksonville fan. He's a Jags fan. I feel bad for all Chargers fans. Well, they're not. Sorry, did I say San Diego? I mean, L.A. I forgot they moved. Yeah. I mean, they shouldn't have because when because when the 49ers come into LA to play in the Chargers at home, all of the 49ers fans take over the entire building. I wonder why. So far. But anyway. <laughs> so um at the at the end of the third, pretty much. So uh, the first quarter was um, <clears throat> a blowout. Second quarter, or um, by the end of the second quarter, the uh, Chargers were at twenty-seven. The Jags were at seven. So they only got a touchdown. They they gave up 20 unanswered points. Chargers got the lead again. Eventually, they got them up to 30. And and into literally, there was no time left on the clock. There was no time left on the clock. and And the Chargers were up 30 to 29. And then I'm assuming Jacksonville scored on that play. 
because that's how you win. They scored on they with no time on the clock. They had a field goal. They went. They get the field goal. So they they win. got it off in time. They missed. They got it off in time. Yep, they got the field goal off. Literally, as with zero, zero time left. Okay. They won. Which is stupid. Really stupid. But now, here's the fun part. The divisional round. Because two teams had a bye week. It was Kansas City and Philadelphia. Okay. Eagles and Chiefs. Yep. So Jacksonville is going up against the Chiefs. Chiefs are winning that. Yeah. Mahomes. Uh, Philly's beating the Giants. They have to. I can. See I'm still gonna say Giants Philly, but I'm gonna say it's gonna be close. I can see the Giants winning that game. Yeah, I'm gonna say Philly still, but I'm gonna. But it's gonna be close. Yeah, I can see it being close. Alrighty, so, and on Sunday it's gonna be Cincinnati versus Buffalo. I'm gonna say That's Buffalo gonna comes out game. with it. That's gonna be, a close but it's gonna be a close game. And I'm finally, Buffalo. and then finally, the game that's probably going to be the most blowout of a blowout: Dallas Cowboys versus San Francisco 49ers. Go 49ers! I hate the, I hate the right, Cowgirls. But... I have no respect for that franchise. <laughs> Fair enough. So, who do you think is going to be our Super Bowl? Is going to be who are your Super Bowl picks for my for the Super two Bowl games? picks? Is Buffalo Bills and the 49ers. I'm the same. I want Buffalo to win, obviously, but I I have to probably say 49ers win it. 49ers are winning it, I think. I'm going to say right now. Um, that team's a freight train right now. They're yeah. just bowling over what? whatever's in their way. All I have to say probably about that, though, is... uh. If Buffalo makes it to the Super Bowl, because they're going to have to go through Kansas City, more than likely are having to go through Kansas City. Oh, yeah, I can see that. Unless uh, Kansas drops the ball all of a sudden. To Jacksonville. Yeah. Not happening. You know what? I, I actually... My gut's telling me don't be surprised if Jacksonville does beat the Chiefs. That would be a major fucking upset. That would be. I wouldn't be surprised because the way that the NFL playoffs work, it's a crapshoot. Anybody could win, literally. Fair. It's a crapshoot. The Rams won last year, and and then they were like, "Look at them now." First teams out. <laughs> But regardless, no. Honestly, I'm gonna if if Buffalo's wins is because they're riding on. We got this far. We're not giving up now. For Demar, I was gonna say, if they do go that far, it's because the team is rallying for Demar, and I have this strange feeling that if and when the Bills make it to the Super Bowl, Demar, I think, will play. Or he will be dressed. I don't think so. I think he might be dressed. I don't think so. You don't? I think he'll be on the field, but I don't think he's going to play. I said he'll be dressed. He'll, he'll be he'll, in like his uniform. He'll, but he'll be a healthy scratch, but he's on the fucking sidelines. Dressed. Okay, yeah. That's, that's what I mean. I can see that. He'll, he'll, Fair he'll, he'll be a backup. <clears throat> yeah. They're going to probably do it for DeMar, and honestly, I want to see it. I'm tired of the Bills being the laughing stock of the NFL. They've been to the Super Bowl how many times and haven't always come up short? Like, what, four times? Yeah. Something like that. But this year, I feel it. I feel it. 
special with you. We're rocking that New Jersey. That literally just came in the mail. It's a clean fucking jersey. Yeah, it literally just just came came in. in. I think that's all we can really say for now. And and this probably won't be a super big uh, series. Because, well, first off, we're in the playoffs. (laughs) The The season's over in like a month. Yeah, but like I said, I don't really pay attention to the NFL until about the last about until about Christmas. That's when I start to actually go, okay, where is everybody? Okay. Let's let's uh tune into playoffs cuz I love playoff football. I love the Super Bowl. It's it's literally There's one some game Super take Bowls where, takes all, no matter what. There are some Super Bowls where I'm just like what the fuck am I watching? This is boring. Oh, the um, 49ers against Chiefs game. What a boring game that was. Like 20, 20, 2019. One of those two years. I don't mm-hmm. remember the exact year. Boring ass game. Boring game. True. But regardless, I think that'll be it for us. Uh, we do not have a Instagram or Twitter page for this. And honestly, we're going to probably see if it even takes off before we, we make anything like that. But I you think, can still reach us both. Yeah, you can still reach us both at, at, at our, um, so on, our, on our social medias, if you don't know them by now. <laughs> Yeah. Go go you watch re- another re- video and just scroll to the end. It's right there. <laughs> plus they're always in plus they're going to be in the descriptions anyway. They yeah. will be in the description. Yeah. 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 <laughs> you know what you're Regardless, doing. Regardless. Right? I know what I'm doing. Do you know what you're doing? I'm falling asleep while editing. Yes, I know what I'm going to be doing. Fantastic. So, well, and as always, I'm Aiden. I'm Chris. This has been No this Picks been Given. No Picks Given. Have a good night, guys. Well, we, we, we might do this next week. We might not. We'll see. <laughs> we'll see. Right. We'll see where we're at. All right. Have a good night. Bye. All right.